All right, welcome to the podcast. Yeah, thank you. I say. Yeah, I say. Am I right? Yeah, I say. <laughs> Your name was Sapphire before. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So what happened? Well, um, I found out that there's a lot of people bearing Sapphire from mm. business artists and so on. Okay. So I decided to change it because I really wanted to stand out. And then when my management came along, yeah. they also suggested that I should change the name. Yeah. So it was really easy. And then I changed it. I see. Then there's the other part of the name. Maria. Oh, what? Maria. Oh, okay. I yeah. never got that. <laughs> Maria. Okay, well, that's cool. Mm-hmm. You you are from Medugri like, originally. Yeah. From Medugri, but yes. You actually based in Beehive. Mm, yeah, I grew up here. Okay. Yes, I grew you up. You were here. born in No, I was born in Gombe. Oh wow. Yeah, I was born in Gombe, and then I. That's my place. Oh. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, I see. It's <laughs> actually a name from a tribe in Gombe. Ah. Uh, yeah. I'm confused now. You were born in Gombe. Mm-hmm. You actually uh, grew up here in Bauchi. Yeah. You're from Medugri. Then your name is f- like from a tribe in Gombe. Yeah. Ah. Uh, <laughs> you're from the north. Exactly. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Now there's a lot of people that actually um compare you to um this lady Thames and um yeah, this Jamaican girl. Kofi. Yeah, Kofi. Mm. Like, how do you feel? I'm sure it must have gotten to you. Of course, it has gotten to me a lot of times. Mm-hmm. I tell people all the time that Kofi is Kofi, um Thames is Thames, yeah. but I want to be more than them actually oh yeah people compare me to a lot of artists Mm -hmm. a lot of them but i feel like they should see me as i see not compare me to anyone and sometimes i tend to feel like it's because of my sound yeah yeah and i want to change constantly develop it so it sounds unique Mm. sounds like i see not any any other artists I, I like that. Yeah. Yeah, I like the fact that you're shying away from that. I've been a victim of something like that before. <laughs> and it doesn't feel good at all. No, it doesn't. Because you're trying to do your stuff and then mm. there's people actually yeah. out there that are trying to compare you to some other people that you'll never be. Exactly. Yeah. So how did you start making music? Well, uh, it's all started like, um, come, let's see, let's vibe, mm-hmm. you get. Mm. So... Um, when so it was not from the church. No, okay. it was from Hall- school. Hallelujah! From <laughs> Everybody started from the church somehow. It started from school. Okay. Yes. Then I I went to church though. Mm. Yes, I went to church because I think everyone in my family is one way or the other involved in music. Okay. Yeah, and then cartoons that I watched also influenced my music. Do you still watch cartoons? I still watch cartoons uh. a lot. <laughs> <laughs> a lot okay, okay. <laughs> yeah okay. which one is your favorite right now <laughs> uh it's still uh 12 dancing princesses from a long time ago i don't know anything yeah. about cartoons <laughs> <laughs> it's fine it's okay. fine yeah so um i watched a lot of them and my music came along with dancing oh you yeah. dance too yeah i dance <laughs> ah, ah. <laughs> ah you know full package of, ah, that's nice so I I was started singing and dancing, actually singing the songs from the cartoons. Mm. Yeah, and then I started writing poetry. Okay. Uh, yeah. I got a book where I wrote anything in that I got from my atmosphere, environment. Yeah. And anything inspiration, I wrote it down there. And then sometimes I would give them tunes. Mm. Yeah, I'll give them tunes and sing it. So I was going on like that, like that. And my friends would say, Won't you go to the studio? Won't you go and record? And then I never went. There was mm. one time I even sponsored my friends to go to the, the studio, studio and record with my own money, but I did not go because Why? I was Why? In this, I was in this yeah, I was sure. scared of taking risky get. I I didn't want to go out of my own box. Uh, yeah, I was oh. just there expecting the miracle actually. And then So what happened? So you met people? Yeah, I met people. Okay, who, like <laughs> who did you meet? I met Sik. 
Oh. Yeah. Sick. It was actually in a photo shoot in uh, 2019. We went for uh, independence shoots. Okay. And then I was so hyped that day. I was so happy. I was singing and dancing at the same time. Mm. And then I don't know how he got interest in me. And then he asked for my handle. Mm. So started talking. And then he asked me to send me one of some of my recording. Okay. And I sent it to him. So one day I was just home. And then he asked, can I come... Uh, so he wants to put me on a song with Joanda, J6, and Planner. Okay. And then I was like, wow, okay. And I just went. To me, I was just like, I'll just do it and go. You mm. get. Mm-hmm. And then I was, it was just like I was having fun because I didn't see it. I, like, I was working on that's, that's the song Paid. Yeah, it gets paid. Okay, yeah, paid. And then I was given some seconds in mm. the track. And then that was just my life changer for me. Wow. It changed. Uh, like listen to that song like almost every day. Like today I played it like three or four times. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Nice song. Mm-hmm. And then that that just those I think about eight or twelve bars. I'm not sure. Yeah. I think you did magic. And then a lot of people are actually um anticipating like what can she do with her own song. Mm. I think it has been a while that song has been out. Yeah. A year plus, I think. Yeah, mm. so, uh, and then you just put out a song mm. not long ago. Yeah. Full for you. Yeah. And I think you matched the hype. It was a great record. Okay. Because, you know, so many times, like, artists just put out songs and maybe a future. Mm. And then it's nice. Yeah. Somebody just got them on the song and then they did a nice future. And then when you come to do their own record, just flops yeah mm. so it's different for you and um it's nice you're one of the first uh persons that i know around here that um a lot of people know about you they don't know you mm. i don't know if i'm even I making understand. any sense people I just understand. know about you you know but me they don't but they don't know me yeah because you you like you just your first record is just out mm-hmm. like just yeah. out but then a lot of people already know about you like from the first song because of what you did on that yes. song it was spectacular yeah. and everybody just love it and now you've started putting out your own record and i think you you'll be more responsible for what you put out now yeah because it's your record now mm. so what are your plans okay so the plan is constantly doing it okay in the process getting better mm-hmm. correcting the flaws because we are working to perfection. I'm working to get it done. Like that. Yeah. So it's o- always constantly working. Mm-hmm. And like, I just feel it's, it, and it comes naturally for me. It comes without any stress at all. Mm. Doing the music. So people will get to know me more because I'm just getting started. And then a lot of things that I didn't think, I, I thought actually, Mm. were challenges for me it was just it just turned out to be my own personal insecurities Mm. so i've gotten over those things and then thankfully there's not a lot of us in the north like you mean girls yeah and girls yeah no girls (laughs) 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 yeah there's not a lot like um um oftentimes Mm like one lady just pops up from somewhere and, and then, then she goes down and she disappears yeah i've I've had critics about that i've mm. had critics about that those mm. are also the things that insecurities too but i've gotten over them mm. like i know that i mean this music thing as my career yeah and i'm not just doing it mm. and then thankfully the society around me is showing me that yes i'm making progress yeah They're showing me that i'm not just doing the music just like that yes. so and i tend to make northeast known out there mm. to the world yeah. that we got something here 